they say contact? Separate thing. And all things considered, we take the time out of things in the proper place. Delving into the why and the how of the story, not just the who, what, and where. We pinpoint what's truly important and grasp the ideas that bring the news into focus. I'm Robert C. Join us every afternoon for all things considered from NPR News. Because the facts matter. This afternoon at 5 o'clock here at WBFO, it is the 15th of November and today begins the central parking restrictions for the winter on city streets. So to be cautious as you park your car overnight, just make sure you're in the right place at the right time. You don't want to have to pay the ticket, that's for sure. Partly sunny early today, although clouds will dominate the day. We've got some snow coming our way as well. Light snow over most of western New York, maybe one to three inches of lake effect snow in these persistent small areas. It's going to be rather cold today with highs only reaching near 30 degrees. It is 20 minutes after 10, it's 31 degrees under mostly cloudy skies. In Buffalo? Hi, we're back. You're listening to Car Talk with us, Click and Collect the Tap and Run. We're here to talk about cars, car repair, and the answer to last week's puzzle. And this one came to us from a listener named Brady Hamill. And I'll just read it as is. I, I didn't think I could have improved it. Well, I could have. I could have obfuscated even more. Right. 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 Anyway, this fellow takes his Volvo to the shop, but, but this could be just about any car. And he complains of a strong pulsing in his brake pedal when he applies the brakes. The mechanic looks over the car and finds that, sure enough, the front disc brake rotors are warped, so he installs new ones and sends the guy on his way. 5,000 miles later, the fellow comes back to the shop and complains that the pulse is back. Suspicious and yet confident that his work was, what, perfect. The mechanic asks the owner a few questions. Do you ride the brake? No. Have you tightened your lug nuts with a high-powered air wrench? No. Have you had a hemorrhoidal flare-up recently? Yes. <laughs> Has anyone had their hands in your lug nuts recently? <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> Have you bought new tires? No. The mechanic is at a loss and begrudgingly replaces the warp rotors. A thousand miles later, the guy comes back and guess what? What? Same problem. I would never have guessed. This time, he asks straight up, what the heck is doing to the car that could be causing this problem? Knowing that there's nothing wrong with the parts and nothing wrong with the installation. The fellow says, geez, I don't know. I, I go on a lot of long trips. It's always the day after I arrive home from these trips that I start feeling the pulsing, but never during the trip. Really? The mechanic then asks him one question and solves the mystery. What question did he ask him? <laughs> I'm afraid, I'm afraid to even venture a guess. <laughs>